Good day. Uh, Matt Davio back with the One Minute Podcast, and I've got a special guest. I wanted uh, occasionally we highlight tools that we feel uh, traders uh, can definitely utilize, and, and we wanted to talk today, uh, as we've got a number of uh, new, news reports, a, a news tool and a, a data tool called Better Trader. And I've got AL with me coming in from, uh, I believe you're in, are you in Israel? Yeah, that's right. So you're in Israel, and, and, and I've been using this product for probably a year or so, and we've been trying to come on. Um, AL, tell us a little bit about how Better Trader started, uh, what really what the process and what the thoughts were behind uh, the developing of the platform, and how traders might take a look at using your product. Okay. Uh, actually, Better Trader, Better Trader started in 2014. I used to be a professional day trader for seven years before, mm -hmm. and uh, in proprietary, one of the leading proprietary trading rooms. And we have a team of analysts, and we get all the news on real time. Uh, this kind of news, like uh, consumer confidence that happened just right now, uh, oil inventories, and so on. And we used to trade based on these releases. We had a team of analysts which process this data and prepare us before the event but still was very hard and challenging to trade it because the markets move and you need to know very quickly what's happened. And that was the source of or the initiate of Better Trader, which is tools that help traders to understand the news, uh, to access the news, first of all, uh, faster than others, to interpret the news better than others, and then to understand what is the impact uh, that could be in the markets faster or better than others. So it means that if something just released, I can understand exactly what's happened, not only if it's stronger or weaker, let's say unemployment rate, not only if it's stronger or weaker, how much is stronger. This is the highest in the last three years. Okay, now I understand exactly what's happened. And then what I care as a trader is how the markets affect with this kind of event in similar situation, which if I have very good memory and very long experience, I can use my brain to do it. But under stress and volatile market, it's not the best idea to do these kind of things by yourself. So professional traders usually have team of analysts and better trader is like this team of analysts. They're doing all the mathematics and statistical calculation on real time and push to you as a trader supportive data. So it means that you can understand um, and act. Now, now here's, here's what I like about it. Uh, you really, you know, your platform is, you, could, you know, you're looking at it online here, obviously, so people can log in on their computer. It doesn't matter whether they're using Mac or, or uh, you know, this is, <laughs> this is an app or is it, uh, you know, is it streaming? Uh, tell us how people can get this. Okay, that's bringing me to, to the time when I used to trade every day. And as a trader, you need to be in front of the screen before the event released, not just after. Right. So this platform is built by, for iOS, Android, to keep you on the go and give you notification 15 minutes before event release and on the computer and desktop iOS so you can see the full version and get more in-depth data to support your decision. So it's both no installation, everything webby on uh, the desktop and of course application for mobile to keep you even you are not in your station. You know, the one thing that I like about it, AL, is, is you know, right here, like I can look at, if, uh, on the left side here, and this, you're showing us your screen, you've got not only the news releases for the day, but the next day. And, and, and so for planning, as far as a trader, right? So today uh, we had consumer confidence. We have the Richmond uh, Manufacturing Index. These aren't big ones for me personally, uh, but as you go forward, you've got not only the news releases from the government, uh, and and by the way, it's not just dedicated to U.S. So you have you can put all the European, the Canadian, uh, Asian markets are all in here. So you've got when the Fed is speaking which is important and uh, you know you know what's amazing is when you look through your list of 
what's going on, and, and this is more commentary, how many interventionists, as I call, are speaking all the time. And, and But it's important to know, hey, this may be what causes the market to move today. You know, just some of these guys speaking, they could slip up, they could say something they're really not supposed to. So it's important to know what's going on and who's speaking and when they're speaking outside of all the, uh, the, the governmental data that is released. Um, so talk to, talk to us a little bit about that and how the schedule, you know, how you can kind of filter, utilize some of the tools. Uh, you know, if, if you only trade U.S. markets, you know, can we get rid of the French consumer spending? Or if I only trade the Spanish markets, can, you know, can, can you just yeah. focus in on those, uh, on those pieces? Yeah. Te technically, we're covering almost every economic event on the country level, as you mentioned. It could be speak. Hold on a second. You kind of cut out there. I can't hear you. Hey, Al, can you hear me? Hey Al, you hit your uh, you accidentally hit your mute button there, so you're gonna have to unmute that. <clears throat> you see how that's muted up there? Hey Al, hang on a second. You were muted there for a second. I don't know what happened. Okay. Yeah, I'm here. Okay. So what they what I just did, I filter the country that I care about. Let's say I want to trade and to be focused on uh, USA and Canada. So, mm -hmm. And I want to filter event with impact medium and high. So mm -hmm. I can see in two minutes, one of the Fed me uh, members is going to speak. Right. Uh, so I can be alerted if it's important and see how the market reacted. Mm -hmm. uh, in one hour, we have like the Bank of Canada governor going to speak, which is important, of course, for the Canadian dollar. So if I have position, I can prepare. Um, you ask about and how they, I, yep. And then you have the, you know, you have the big API crude number, and then tomorrow you've got um, the, you know, the big crude number coming out, and Yellen's testifying. So again, a lot going on in the next couple of days. What I like about this platform is you can integrate the charts, and I happen to use TradingView charts, and you guys are utilizing their charts also. So yeah, yeah go into this a little bit more and how you can filter and how you can do some of these things. Oh, let, let's go, let's start with the crude oil inventories which are going to release tomorrow. I can get into the event and get some interesting statistics like how the market reacted with the silver and the oil, which there is extremely stronger number for the crude oil inventories, which is this could be very interesting uh, because extreme stronger uh, inventories, which is much less barrels than uh, expected, instead of bring uh, like lift the oil, could six out of nine times move down following similar releases. So even before the event release tomorrow, I can be very cautious if the event going to be extremely stronger, it's not a good idea to buy the oil because many times six out of nine, the oil moves very significantly down mm -hmm. after this kind of release. So if I'm going to trade the oil in extreme stronger release, probably I will short it and not start to, to try to buy every new low because that's not how the market interpret it. So right, right. everything we can get here with real-time charts. So you can choose like five minutes, uh, one hour daily, whatever you like everything real time inside the system um so you can be prepared and, like it could be kind of your working station in one uh, place you can see everything include all the major economic events that's going to be so you won't be surprised uh you can get yeah can you uh like i trade off of uh i happen to clear uh, utilize cqg as one of my platforms so with that is integrated with trading view can you uh if i were a customer that uses that through trading view could i trade off of my charts just like i do with trading view we do not have integration with trading view we start to have integration with different brokers like you can say here i connected to trader 
Mm. And uh, first of all, every user that we have can get demo account for practice mm -hmm. inside the, the, the platform. And okay, so oh, you have CQG in there. Yeah, you have CQG in there. Yeah, we are in the process to integrating with CQG too. Uh, yeah, and very good things coming forward. So we see this and we get a lot of feedback from traders that want to trade and analyze from the same place and to get some better insights about uh, events, which means that they can not only see the news and follow them and know about the volatility, uh, to understand really what happened, which um, I want to go through some test case. It's real test case, it's not like uh, fiction. What you see here on the right side, it's deeper view about our uh, analysis system. Let's say that tomorrow going to be the unemployment rate. And you, talk, you asked me before about preparation. There is unemployment rate and they want to be able uh, to get ready before the event. What it means, I can simulate releases. We don't know as well you what's going to happen tomorrow. If the unemployment rate rate could, going to be positive or negative. Mm -hmm. In this system, we can simulate. Let's assume uh, that the unemployment rate going to be negative, more unemployment than expected. And then we're running uh, in the last three years, all the time that unemployment rate was higher than expected. How the market reacted, which market should they trade? The oil, the currency, the S&P 500, and what I can get here, eight out of nine times, S&P 500 moved up following similar releases. Mm -hmm. And it's not like a trading signal, let's buy market, no. You can get here the charts and see 7 July 2017, it happened, you can see what happened 15 minutes before and from the moment of the release. Mm -hmm. Let's scroll down. February 3rd, you can get the same chart 15 minutes before, 90 minutes after, you can see the market. Uh, October 7th, a lot of noise and so on. And, and and that's nice. And and I see you have like the percentage moves on the right on the scale there. So people can real quickly get an idea kind of what has happened based on different scenarios, as you said, the release magnitude, you know, is it extreme? Uh, obviously, you guys are setting the parameters on that, but you can kind of go in there and, and if you like binary events, and we always say binary events are, you know, especially, as you said, jobs, oil numbers that come weekly, the jobs number, uh, first yeah. Friday, you know, these, yeah. these, these things we all know. How about uh, grain reports? Do you have uh, USDA grain reports in your, in your system? Uh, we're, we're currently not covering the grain reports. We're covering all the CFTC numbers, uh, but not the grain. So you have uh, uh, the commitment of trader re reports in here? Yes. Yes, natural gas storage as well, according to like, uh, commodities, mm -hmm. um, GDP number, CPI, and so on. Um, this system should be to give you one thing like trade idea of the general direction in similar situation. Right. Second, to prevent you from losses, let's, let's take this event like unemployment rate. If it's negative unemployment rate, our, our human logic said, okay, let's, it's not good for the companies, let's sell the S&P 500. So in this case, at least if I'm not going to buy the S&P 500 after negative release, for sure I'm not going to short it. Because here you can see, it's not something that happened just one time. The market like it. Right. The reason why it like it, we can reverse engineer and understand that it comes from uh, the interest rate and so on. But the main logic is to give the trader uh, what the market thinks about events like happening now, mm -hmm. including uh, volatility, uh, which instrument it's better to be focused to trade because we as a trader, if there is general direction up and the volatility is very big, probably we can reach our stop loss. So here with the S&P 500, we can see there is much less volatility than the EUR USD, which mm. probably, even if I will get in the right direction, I will squeeze out by stop loss. So it's kind of supportive 
to give you real indication what happened in similar situation and of course prepare for the next event what you you can trade so right yeah that's good and 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 i said uh, as you said i use it quite a bit uh on my mobile device i like having uh it's kind of doing my homework the night before. Hey, I, I use it to kind of scroll through what's coming tomorrow, what's going to be important, uh, make some notes where I could see some moves. I try to use it with my charts, kind of like you are. I try to prepare and say, if you know this is stronger uh, or if this is super weak, what may, you know what might happen. And and this is the type of thing that uh, again, kind of. I talk about all the time you have to be prepared in game theory and say okay what if this is super extreme where could this market go and how will I behave around that I, I think it's always better to prepare for uh, events that may happen uh, versus you know being shocked when they do happen so I always like to play the game you know what happens if we are super um, you know the jobs number is really poor or it's really weak and 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 what you know what ha what has happened in the past and this is a great way for a great tool for people that that can kind of they then don't have to go back and figure out what date it was uh because it's not always the first friday if there's a holiday you know that that we yeah. have jo jobs sure. right so you guys have all this data how far back do you go how many years do you go we can go even 10 years back. Uh, we found uh, by uh, running uh, calculation and optimization that the default time to go back, it's about three years. So when you get analysis based on these charts and backtester automatically to your phone, you can, you can know that it's based on three, the last three years. And when you want to test it by yourself on the backtester, you can change here the time frame and look back more years or less and you can see like wider chart like uh two hours or three hours after the event release so you okay. can get so for longer term traders like myself who you know i'm not so concerned about the immediate move unless it's coming into uh an area that i'm concerned with uh you can you can obviously schedule uh, as you said times that work for you and and time frames exactly. and how and how you trade and that's really important i think Exactly. Here I, here I did like uh, another test case of stronger release of unemployment rate and the best trade is to like three hours after the release mm -hmm. and the best trade is just uh, maybe to be focused on the silver. 13 right. out of 13 times the silver uh, moved up. It's important to say that when we said nine times out of 13 moved up, it means that in those nine times, the market, the drawdown that you feel as a trader, it's not big. It means that you can suffer it and it makes sense according to your leverage, according to your rewards, and you can hold this trade. And when we said like four out of this 13, not good opportunity, it means that consider small stop that you exceeded. So maybe the market went down 1% and then up 3%. It's not a good trade because you can't hold 1% against you. So in this case, we consider this as a fail. And the nine times that it's win, it means that if you just, with the, the way that we executed here, we are assuming that you buy one minute after the release. So all the noise on the first minute, all the algo trading, all these kind of things, we assume that you, are, you need your time to understand the data that you get from here to understand the market and you just open position one minute delay after the release in the open of the candle. So it give you some general understanding how the market reacted with risk of trader, not a hypo hypothetic risk and reward, like something mm -hmm. that you can hold by yourself without suffering too much, which is m very important for traders. Well, it's especially important if you are trading around binary fast moving events as you're suggesting and uh, As I always say, you know, if you're not experienced at this type of trading Then this is a great tool to practice with uh, and, and get better at it because you can kind of you know experience these these calendar events over time um, and, and and really, you know play through them 
how can people, um, you know, trial your product? What's the best way for them uh, to take a look at this? Uh, and, and, and then also, I want you to talk a little bit about sentiment. Uh, you've got that button up there, sentiment and correlation. Um, can, you can you touch on those a little bit in addition? The sentiment and correlation, it's two segments that we, uh, we release uh, next year. What you see here, it's a new version that's still inside. Um, next year, we are preparing to release these two features. Both of them going to be based on economic events. This is our specialities. So we're going uh, to release this more. For now, I think there is a lot of value, and we see the feedback from professional traders that we use, that using this, that the system helps them to track the market, to prepare, and based on their feedback, we're still developing the sentiment and correlation, which will be next year. Okay, I like the idea of that because I do, uh, I have my own sentiment and correlation studies that I utilize, so I, I'd be very interested in seeing those myself. So that's, that's, that's really interesting. So how can people, uh, where do they need to go uh, to get a trial from you? And uh, are there any, uh, you know, any special offers that you can give our viewers here at One Minute Trader that uh, you know, might give them a special uh, advantage over just anybody else? Yeah. Um, first of all, the place that uh, people can reach us and uh, get more knowledge in 14 days trial with full access, it's betatrader.co, not com, betatrader.co, yeah. And special and you offers... Can see, and you can see yeah. that up here in the upper left, so it's betatrader.co is where yeah. you can su yeah. sign up for the trial, right? Yeah, and after you sign up to the trial, uh, one minute trader can get three months for free, which is will be with uh, activation in your site. So every trader that will subscribe on the form on your website and blog, uh, you will deliver it to us. And then after they already signed up for the 14 days trial, we will activate their account for another three months. This That's is, great. Uh, so you're gonna you're gonna yeah. allow people to give this a trial for. For 90 days, uh, you yeah. know, through through a link on our website, and we'll we'll provide that here at the end of the uh, webinar here. So, yeah. anything else that you want to say about uh, Better Trader today, Al? Uh, I think it's a neat product. Um, I, like I said, I've used it. You and I have been working together, uh, you know, with suggestions and and things, and you guys keep tweaking and and adding better features. I really like the product. From a, a discovery, a price discovery standpoint, it's it's fantastic. Hmm. So it just keeps going there. You should be okay now. Hey, Al, are you there? There you go. Uh, must be here. I can hear you now. Yeah, very good. Okay, so Al, thanks again for coming on today. We appreciate you taking the time to explain BetterTrader.co to the One Minute Trader uh, viewers. And if you have any questions, you can see Al's email is right here, and it's it's listed right here. Feel free to drop him a, a note there, and we're going to put a link on here where you can you can extend your trial from two weeks to three months. And uh, we hope you like the product because I do use the product and I, I, I only talk about things really uh, that I utilize as tools because uh, I think it's best to have smart tools and, and straightforward and simple tools. What I like about this product is it tells me when not only the economic events that, uh, in markets that I trade and, and, and that will affect my markets, when they're happening, but they also, uh, it really helps me to know, and it also exposes how many of the, <laughs> look, I mean, just look at today, how many Fed, Fed, Fed speakers and Treasury Secretary speaking, yeah. all these guys, all these guys do is talk. Crazy, isn't it? Yeah, and they're moving the market a lot, some of them. Yep. Yeah. Unexpectedly, if you're not uh, prepared, yeah. Yeah, and if you don't know that they're talking and they're at a big event, it's possible. <clears throat> it's possible you could uh, be shaken out of a position 
short term. And so it's better sometimes just to know when these guys are talking. Uh, and, and you can take advantage of these this, you know, price discrepancies because of the way that people react to something that was said. So oftentimes you can get a better entry, lower if you're looking to buy, higher if you're looking to sell, just because these people are speaking. So know what is important and how to take advantage of it uh, using, you know, in, in, in our world, I, we utilize market profile and uh, TPOs. Uh, obviously, you can use use your charts here with trading view you could probably add on uh, I've got you know all my market profile information here on my trading view charts so I'm assuming you can probably add those here also al to your charts yeah, yeah you can you can add here whatever you have like it's full right. trading ability yes like, the trading view so you can add yeah. you can add your own charts just as you have here yeah. uh, and look yeah. at anything you want which is awesome uh, and I'm yeah, a big proponent the charts Natural gas, let's say, and you, you're all good. All right. Well, thanks for coming on today, Al. I appreciate it. And BetterTrader.co is where you can get the free trial, and I definitely encourage people to do that. It's a great product, and uh, we'll be talking to you soon. Thank you, Matt. Talk to you soon. Thank you. Bye bye, and good luck. Thanks.